Welcome to the support videos for Digital Business Automation video series. This video will show you how to create a report in Control-M Reports for Control-M 9018. Then save the data as a CSV formatted file and create a graph from it. Control-M Reports can be found in the Workload Automation GUI client in the Tools domain. It's under Other Tools is Control-M Reports. So we'll open it, and it looks like this. So we'll go to the upper left-hand corner, click Report, Add New Report. Over to the right, we can see we've got several uh, ones under Active. I'm going to pick Active Jobs, and then I will click Add. So now we see the opening screen for this uh, report. Uh, you can filter by various things. I'm going to leave it. Current active network is what I want to see. Um, you can also uh, add some things, uh, but uh, that's uh, that's sufficient for me for the moment. Uh, we'll pick columns. Columns will let you see what's going to appear in your report. So we've got a number that we could add by just dragging them over to the visible columns from the available columns. I'm actually going to remove one. I'm not interested in member name. I'm just going to have a very simple report with the application, sub application, and job name. So I'll just remove that one from the visible columns. Okay, so I've gone to the view tab. I'm going to add a sorting column. I will sort by application. I will not add a grouping column. Uh, that's only available for PDF, and we're going to export with CSV. I'm going to do a preview here. Click the preview down at the bottom and refresh. And we can see some of the records in our report. So now I need to save the report. That's in the upper right corner. I'll click save. And then I need to uh, export the uh, data from, uh, found by the report. So I do that also in the upper right corner with the generate button. That allows me to save it as a CSV that I can open another things and produce a graph from. So now it says that it's been saved. I've now opened my CSV file in Microsoft Excel, which opens it quite nicely. All I had to do is adjust the width of the columns to fit the data. Now I'm going to select the data, and I'll be able to make a graph out of it. So having selected it, I'll go to Insert, Recommended Charts, gives me the option of a, it'll make a clustered bar graph with either by sub-application or by application. I want to uh, group it by application. Click OK. That makes a very nice chart. Make it a little bigger to be easily seen. So you can see it's very easy by using Control and Report's ability to export a CSV file uh, to uh, gather the data that you want to analyze and pull it into a program that can uh, make nice graphs from it. That concludes this control M Solutions video. The Digital Business Automation Support Team looks forward to helping you whenever you need our assistance.